All right, guys, doing a little work on the uh, SCX6. Grease in here uh, pretty much diminished away. Uh, I've only had the thing out maybe six or seven times. I always use my own marine grease. Uh, seems to hold up the best. You know, it's really good when it comes to water. It still sticks to stuff. The Axial grease that was in here is pretty much non-existent anymore. Um, so I threw some of that in. And now I'm going to take off the tires, have a look at the diffs, and let you guys see, because I've been hearing a lot of rumors that the grease doesn't hold up. So if it's not there, marine grease. Let's get those tires off. All right, let's pop this off and see what we got. Well, I don't know, it's not too bad in there, but everything's still spinning great. I'm gonna throw a little more in here just because I tend to be in a lot of water. And in the water, if you ain't got this stuff, stuff's gonna rust and fast. On for a second. Give it a bit of a spin. See what she looks like. So yeah, most of my grease is in there and took. So we'll close her back up. Um, so from my perspective, it's not too bad. I just prefer marine grease because of the way it protects. So. I mean, for the average person who doesn't run in all that much water, you'd probably be fine. As you can tell by my table here, we run in a lot of water, so... I mean, it's probably best for me to throw in that extra bit of grease. I know my transmission really needed it, so be warned that I would open that up and throw in some proper diff or marine grease or something better than what they've got going on in there, because it's it ends up being too liquidy. All right, guys, so... Um, like I said, it's basically to show you what that diff looks like. And uh, really, like, that's that's pretty liquidy for grease in a diff. Um, I'm not sure how well you can see that. I mean, there's grease there, but it's nothing that's going to stand up or anything to some good water. So it's... Uh, mm -hmm. But yeah, as you can see, it's not the greatest, so... When I put in my marine grease, I am not shy with it. I always make sure to overload, basically. All right, guys. So that was a look into the diffs. Um, my personal recommendation, swap out that grease. It, it looks like it's just going more liquidy as time goes on. And uh, putting mine in there actually quieted it up a little bit. You're not getting the full metal on metal all the time, which makes it pretty decent. So, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, check out the rest of the channel. See this thing running. It's pretty cool. All right, thanks, guys. We'll see you in the next one.